welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be a week in my life like what the average life is like when you're in the Disney college program so i'm off today and i'm gonna go to animal kingdom with my friends i literally just woke up on chapstick i have my makeup all sitting right here i don't really know what i'm wearing but i'm gonna post up some raisin cinnamon bagels sit down do my makeup and get ready to go it's currently 10 o'clock and we want to meet up at 12 and i have a speech due tonight because i am taking classes and i work uh the fourth of july is this week <coughs> sorry the fourth of july is this week and i work the fourth of july so i'll be able to take you guys i can't take you guys to work if you want to see what the average week looks like in disney college program keep watching Okay, so I finished my makeup, my hair. I put my hair in a ponytail because my new growth is clockable and it doesn't look good when I wear it down. So until I have time to like update my braids, an uh, update was what we need to do. And I didn't really lay my edges because last time I laid my edges, a lot of gunk got built up into my braids because I didn't like wash the got to be glue, not the got to be glue, the gorilla knot out. So I just like, I'm just rocking with like natural edges. And it looks better when I wear my ponytail all to one side other than it like scattered everywhere because it just looks thin and like a mess. So I think this is like my natural side, like I look better on. So I think I'm gonna wear my braid to that side whenever I take pictures or anything. And I'm just wearing this Boohoo crop top and some American Eagle jeans and you see some vans I'm about to head out i'm supposed to be meeting up with the people i'm going with in nine minutes and i'm heading out now and animal kingdom i don't really know how far it is because i don't work at animal kingdom but we're gonna have fun i'm ready so let's go I hope you guys liked that little snip clip of me at Animal Kingdom. I had a lot of fun. I rode Everest. I rode the dinosaur ride, which I honestly like. My eyes were closed for most of that. Um, I rode, oh, Pandora. Pandora, I rode first. Then the dinosaur ride. Then, oh, sorry. It's just so hot. I'm just trying to get all this sweat off of me. I didn't even get a picture, so... It's okay because right now I'm about to go back, do my speech for my public speaking class. Hair is looking a little rough. I didn't lay my edges either, like I said before. I just built up so much gunk on there and I was just like, eh, no thank you. So yeah, I'm about to go back to my apartment, do my public, do my speech for my public speaking class. I've been practicing my speech. It's kind of together, it's kind of not. I know the lighting is like ass right now, but I just finished my speech. I'm uploading it right now. I had to take two times to upload it and it's just like, oh, it's almost uploaded. Here we go. After like 10 tries, I just finally finalized my speech and got what I wanted to say. I wanted to do it all in one take. I didn't want to like have to edit it or anything. 
So this is be three minutes and I did two minutes and 50 seconds. So right now I changed my outfit. I'm wearing a rain jacket because it's raining, some sweatpants, some flip flops. It's raining outside, so I'm gonna be comfy cozy. I'm gonna go get some more groceries for the week. I typically grocery shop once a week, sometimes twice. But I never buy anything like really stupid expensive. I usually buy just like fruit and bread or chicken or something that I'm gonna cook for the week since we do get paid weekly. Um, and then I'm going to pick up one of my close friends from Universal and take her over to Magic Kingdom because she asked for a ride. She said she'd give me gas money, so I said okay. Secured. Bag is secured. Taking it to the car right now. AKA, or once again, bag is secured. Okay, so I know the lighting is like terrible, but there's something that I really always wanted to say, and I'm gonna make a whole video about this, but just about financials and money with the college program. So you really have to be like strict about it. Like you don't get paid that much. It's a week to week paycheck, so it's split in half what you would make, like, you know. For the two week paychecks I usually get, but like, it's really smart. I just can't wait to make this video because I have so much to say about like the financial aspect of the Disney College program and like what it's really taught me and what I've been going through while I've been here for like the past month. So you just have to be really smart. I know for me, what I do right now, and I'll touch more on this when I make the video. I know I keep saying that, but just know I'm gonna touch more on it when I make the video. For right now, I make two big meals every week, especially when I'm being really productive on my stuff. I make two big meals every week for lunch and dinner. So one week I had pasta. It was like a pasta, broccoli, chicken, tomato, Alfredo dish. I made that. I made a lot of it. Every time I make big dishes, I make a lot of it so I can store it in my refrigerator, put it in a Tupperware, and I can just eat that at work so I don't have to worry about spending money at the parks or anything else like, or anything else like that because food is not cheap in the break room. I'm sorry. It's so high, I got you on the air. Food is not cheap in the break room. You would think that since we're employees, um, it would be like a little bit cheaper just so, just to give us like, you know, like thank you for working here, but it's, it's cheaper, but it's not as cheap as you would like it to be compared to your paycheck. So I personally bring home lunches and I'll bring one big meal for lunch, one big meal for dinner. Uh, like I said before, I did the pasta and then I would do like, well, what else do I usually have? Like chicken and rice or fish and rice. So I'll have a big Tupperware full of pasta and a big Tupperware full of fish and rice. I can either flip flop it, switch it, have one for lunch, the other one for dinner. That's usually what I do just so my taste buds get a break from the same meal over and over again. But as long as the meal is still good, it really doesn't matter. I usually don't get tired, so yeah, that's really all I had to say. A video will be coming soon. I just thought I'd say that since, you know, it's it's like a, it wakes me up and it calls me again every time I grocery shop, just how much I have to be smart with my money because I do save half my paycheck. And so if we're already not getting paid as much, as you think because we do pay rent every month and then I save half of that and then just paying bills and all sorts of kind of stuff. It's just, it's tight. It's tighter than I would like it to be. How about that? So you just have to be really, really considerate. So yeah, all right. Enough with the sad, sappy, I'm broke talk. Let's go ahead and continue on with the video. Good morning, it is Tuesday and I am up. I have work at three, but I never got to show you guys the groceries that I picked up from the store. I wanted to do a grocery haul, but then I went to go pick up my friends and then just went to bed and stuff. So I'm gonna show you guys all the stuff I got last night and all the meals I plan on making for this week. So I got some medium raw shrimp that's frozen, some cereal, oats and honey, two things of raspberries, cause I go through those really fast. Some mild salsa. Can you see? Is it focused? There you go. Some mild salsa. Some strawberry poppy seed dressing. Some feta cheese. I really like feta cheese on my salads. Some strawberries. Some chocolate almond milk. I've actually was like craving this. I was actually craving chocolate milk. But then I don't drink regular milk. So I was like, wow, I wonder if they have chocolate almond milk. And I saw it. I got some blueberries and then some lettuce for my salads. So that's all I picked up last night. So for my two meals that I make every week, I'm going to make um, shrimp tacos 
And I'm gonna actually make two meals out of this shrimp. I'm gonna make shrimp tacos for dinner and then I'm going to make a shrimp berry salad that they actually sell at the place that like, at the park that I work at. Um, I'm gonna make a shrimp salad with strawberries, blueberries, raspberries, and the strawberry like dressing with the feta cheese. And then I also have some avocados sitting out in the sun. So I'm gonna, and I bought some tortillas and I bell peppers and stuff. And I bought the salsa. So I'm gonna make the shrimp to go for both the salad and some tacos. So yum. Right now I'm about to make some breakfast. I'm gonna make a cinnamon raisin bagel and eggs. I think I might have a sandwich. Actually probably not because the cinnamon raisin bagels are sweet and I don't really like mixing sweet and salty. So I think I'll probably have some toast and eggs. And then I have some homework to do and I need to finish reading up on my book for my class because I have a quiz due on, on um, 12 chapters on Friday. I'm only on like chapter four. So I need to do that. And I have a couple hours which I'm glad because I'm not like rushing out the door. So yeah, I'm gonna cook breakfast, put these groceries away and enjoy my little part of the day before I have to go to work. Okay, so I look crazy right now. I just got home from work and I made some like shrimp tacos. It's currently like 9.30. I'm gonna shower, probably listen to my audio book, maybe one chapter, it's so boring though. I'm gonna show you guys the shrimp tacos that I made. They're really good. And then I'm going to go to bed. So yeah. One more thing, I'm at like this awkward angle because I'm not trying to show like my uniform and stuff. But the shrimp berry salad, like, it just wasn't for me. I don't know what I was thinking. It's just, uh, it wasn't that, all that. My hair is like, my hair is here, trust me. But this wasn't all that. So now I'm just gonna use all my shrimp to make and eat tacos, which I don't even have that much shrimp left. Honestly, there wasn't that much shrimp in that bag. I don't know, maybe I should have bought two bags. Maybe I'll go back and buy another bag. But let me show you guys the tacos. So I bought like a really big tortilla, like I split the tortilla in half. This is supposed to be one tortilla and I put it on the pan and I like, you know, warmed it up and I have shrimp, um, some like pinko de gallo, salsa, cheese and sour cream and it is hitting right now, let me tell you. Ladies and gentlemen, this is our world famous Cantonese. 